So today's video is going to be another wash day routine on Harmony's hair. If you guys did not watch my previous video, I did go ahead and unbox this curl box for you guys. So the brand that I'm going to be using today is from Eden Body Works and it's the Lavender and Aloe Collection. This is my first time using these products on Harmony here. Um, I'm not going to go through each and every product for you guys because I did that in my previous video. So once this video is is over I want you guys to head and watch that previous video of the unboxing but if you guys are new to this channel what's up um, I hope you guys hit that subscribe button as well as hit that like button and drop your girl a comment and let me know if you're a new subby so the first product we really going to start off with is the moisturizing co-wash but y'all i was really amazed how this co-wash took to her hair i honestly never used a co-wash before now what i like about this collection is the smell the smell of these products smells so good the smell is not overpowering it does linger in your hair i feel like each product smells the same now with this co-wash it had a lot of slip and that's what I love you know harmony do have low porosity here so you guys may be thinking I'm a little too rough but y'all when I'm doing her hair and my hair I really have to work the product into our hair if I do not do that the product would just sit on our hair and it really defeats the purpose of a wash day so that's why you guys see me you know really working the products into her hair no I'm not hurting her if I was hurting her she would tell me like look ma stop you doing too much she would tell me if i'm hurting her but the co-wash did have a lot of slip it did smell good and it was so easy for me to detangle her hair which was very surprising now on to the deep conditioner this is the anti-breakage deep conditioner if you guys did not see my first time ever um video of me trying eden body works deep conditioner i'm gonna leave it up in the cards for you guys guys i was really skeptical of trying and using this deep conditioner on harmony here because of the previous experience that i had so i'm like oh my gosh this product is not gonna work it's just gonna sit on her strands it's not gonna do nothing for her here y'all when i tell you this product is bomb it smells really good left her hair feeling moisturized after i washed the deep conditioner out her hair felt so soft it was like really fluffy and airy and i really didn't have too much of a hard time working the product onto her hair i did have to you know take my spray bottle and wet her hair a little bit and work the product through this deep conditioner did not sit on her strands and if you are a person that have low porosity hair you guys know Sometimes with products, the struggle really be real. Products sometimes tend to sit on our strands and it's very annoying. But I was really amazed and honestly, using this deep conditioner, it definitely made up for my horrible experience of my last Eden Body Works deep conditioner. So out of all the products in this collection, the deep conditioner is definitely, definitely, definitely my favorite one. The deep conditioner is kind of thick. Because I was not doing Harmony here, I was kind of cautious of using the... um the hair and body butter because I did take Harmony to the hair salon and when I do take her to the hair salon, they do ask um, us to wash her hair beforehand and don't add any product. So you guys will not see me try out the hair and body butter, but I will definitely do a, another review on how I moisturize and seal either my hair or Harmony hair. And I will definitely let you guys know what I think about the um, hair and body butter. So y'all, it is like almost a week later. Harmony was not feeling good. She missed like the first couple of days of school and she did not want me to do her hair at all. So I was like, you know what? I'ma just let baby girl rest 
and once she feel up to it then i am going to do her hair she did you know rock the puff for about a week until it was time for her to go to the hair salon and did get her hair done. That's why you guys see me wetting down her hair because I did take her hair out of her little puff and her hair was definitely dry. The next item I did use in her hair was the moisturizing leave-in. With this product, a little bit really does go a long way which is kind of shocking for me to say because I am very, very heavy-handed with products. Now, as y'all watch, when I was applying like the co-wash, when I was applying the deep conditioner and the leave-in, I made sure to definitely get Harmony ends. I made sure to get her ends because sometimes when we wash our hair, we tend to forget about the ends of our hair. So I made sure the ends of her hair was very well coated with each and every one of these products but this leave-in it definitely melted the little knocks and kinks that was in her hair and it, it kind of did give her hair like a, a nice little shine i can definitely see myself purchasing a big bottle of this leave-in conditioner and like i said it really it definitely smells really good so i did go ahead and blow dry harmony hair off camera i eventually will be doing a video on how i blow dry dry harmony hair so after i detangled each section i did put it, her hair in four quadrants and blew her hair out using this leave-in conditioner and the other two products that i normally use to blow dry her hair it made the blow drying process so easy now this is um how Harmony Hair turned out after she did go to the hair salon. A couple of days later, I did go in and I did use the oil to moisturize her scalp. This is not a heavy oil. I would say it's it's more so of a lightweight oil. I did go in and lightly spray some of her hair with this hair refresher it did give it a nice little shine and i could tell that her scalp was you know moisturized but overall i do like this collection this is gonna be another one of my favorite collections to use on harmony hair but i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did don't forget to hit that like button as well as hit that subscribe button and make sure you guys turn on your post notifications so when i do drop another video you guys won't miss it